How you doing? This is Eric. Uh, today I'd like to talk about races, racism, cultures, creeds, all these things that interfere with us uh, just being humans. Uh, you know, you look at a lot of these people and they're, they're just spouting such filth on YouTube. Uh, yes, I know the white man's evil, but not all white men are evil. Uh, last I checked, 6.6 uh, .6 billion, 6 .8, you know, it might be 7 billion for all I know now, but um, I'm not quite the mathematician that my wife is, so I asked her to uh, run some numbers for me. Uh, it used to be the 10 percenters, we used to call them the 10 percenters, now those 10 percenters are the 3 percenters. So all the wealth in the world, all of it, is run by 280,000 people. So maybe they're racist, I know I'm not. So when you look at their minions and the people that are working for them, they're pretty clear to see because they're, uh, you know, they are behind the covers these days, but they still show themselves pretty, uh, pretty easily, pretty reasonably easily found. Now, I have a problem with a lot of these uh, reverse racists that are, you know, they hate whitey kind of thing, but in reality, <clears throat> they're just haters. They're racist themselves. So I would ask everybody, you know, take a minute. If you know a racist, because, you know, I know a lot of racists, I take the time to talk about my family, which is, uh, you know, I'm seven different nationalities. My, my children are ten different nationalities. Uh, we are the new world. Um, and I am teaching my child to be very strong, but, but for the most part, the most important part is reading and caring for other people. Read, read, read. The more you read, you'll find that they put you into where you're at. Don't you realize that, you know, most people aren't haters? If we all got together as a human race, we could, we could weed out these people. Probably not going to happen. Uh, looking at all the things that are going on in our sun right now, the moon, the constellations, everything is, is being upended and changing. Our planet is about to go through some type of change. Now, people that are filled with hate are probably not going to make it to the other side, much less the people that aren't filled with hate. So again, this narrow road that I'm trying to follow is, is about being Christ-like. That means in action. So I didn't really want to put my face on YouTube because of, uh, obviously, some of the very, very uh, dangerous people that, that view these sites. There's a lot of people that are um, angry. I would ask all of them to actually listen to some of my tapes. I mean, I've only got four videos out there. I've erased a couple of them because, you know, nobody was looking at them. So here you go. This is for all you racists and, and uh, culturalists, all, all you people that are holding on to what you have instead of enjoying what you have and sharing it with people. You know, I live in Los Angeles and, you know, I can go have Indian food, you know, the best curried food you could imagine. I can have the best Mexican food. I can have the best Korean food. You know, I can go have the best Japanese sushi if I want. Uh, you know, we're a mixing pot here in Los Angeles and as I assume any giant city is. Uh, but I'm starting to see a lot more violence and a lot more hate as, as a you know, the cream's not rising to the top, the, the uh, frustrations and evil of this world is rising to the top. So stand with me, again, stand with me and be strong with me, and let's try to change this world, one person at a time. Let's uplift one person at a time. Thank you.